Hi everyone. So we start teaching remotely next week in New York City and a bunch of my colleagues have asked how can they see their students in a Google Meet or in a Zoom at the same time while they're also presenting a lesson. So I'm going to show you how to do that in a really fast and easy way. There's no extra equipment and best of all this is free. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go into your web browser. You're going to go into Google Chrome and the next thing you're going to do is you're going to go to Chrome dot google.com and you're going to go to the Chrome Web Store and you're going to click up here to extensions and you're going to look for the extension called Duelist. So you're going to download it by clicking on it and you're going to install it to your Chrome browser. If you don't see it pop up here you can just click on this icon here and it will appear with the rest of your extensions. And then you're going to want to pin this one because this is one you're going to use daily in your instruction. And then it will appear up here so you can just click on it easily. So once you've downloaded this um, extension, you're going to click on it. It looks like two screens. This is what it looks like. So you're going to click on the icon here. And you're going to choose the sizing for what you want to use. So I like using the sizing where the windows are even, but you can choose whatever you think is going to work best for you. Once you click on that, you'll see that the window I was in separated from the rest of them. So what I typically like doing is I like having whatever I'm presenting on the left-hand side of the screen, and I like having my Google meet open on the right hand side. So I'm going to just take my tab with my lesson that I already had open and I'm going to move it to the left. All I did was drag it over there. So I just took it and I dragged it and it moved. Now let's say you don't really like the sizing of these windows. You can also drag the borders of the windows to a sizing you prefer. So then you're going to go here into the browser on the right. I already made a Google Meet just so you could see how it is set up. So I have my lesson, my slideshow, whatever it is I want to present here, my worksheet on the left and I have my Google Meet on the right. And remember you can just drag the tabs back and forth to whichever side you want them on. So if something appears over here that you don't like you can move it to the right and vice versa. Now how do you present your stuff? You're gonna click on present now or share screen on Zoom and you're going to click on instead of clicking on entire screen or a window you're going to select a Chrome tab because you see I have other tabs open I don't want the kids seeing all that other stuff I just want them seeing this slide so this is my waiting room area that I have for when kids first enter the Google Meet so I'm going to click on a Chrome tab and then it's going to list all my Chrome tabs I want the one up here that says Mrs. Monix waiting room. I'm going to click on that and it'll let me know that this tab is being shared by letting me see it up here. And it also lets me know I'm sharing here, but it says sharing this tab. This side is letting me know I'm sharing something. This is the tab I'm sharing. So now if I just share this, this is really tiny, the kids may not be able to see it as well. I want to present the whole thing, but I don't want to block my view of my kids who will be over here. So I'm going to click present on this side. And now I'm in present mode, my kids can see the presented version of this, the bigger version of this. And my kids will be on this side and I can see them all. And if I can't see them all, I can make this a little smaller and this side a little bigger. And that's how you use Duelist to present your information and to see your kids at the same time. Now when I'm done, I just hit stop. If I want to switch tabs, I can click on present now and share a different tab. So that's how easy this is to use. I hope you like this video. Please like it if you do and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks.